Hey guys, it's Running Kimono. So even before we talk about the awesome haul today that I've done on this wonderful Thursday, um, we're going to talk very quickly about Fetch Rewards app. It is by far of all the apps, my absolute favorite. And between now and next Tuesday, when you sign up, they're offering new signups, um, extra 3000 points. When you submit your first receipt, it could be anything. It could be a pack of gum that you bought last week at Walgreens. And the kicker to this of why it's such a fantastic app is once you hit 3000 points, guys, you can actually qualify for a gift card. I mean, a $3 Amazon, $3 to CVS, $3 to Target, give it to charity. I mean, what a fantastic way to start the, um, weekend. So if you want to check out the um, link in the notes, uh, please do so. And don't forget to use my code to get that extra 3000 points. I mean, how fantastic is that? Hey guys, it's Running Kimono and I know I haven't made one of these videos in a really long time or actually show you a haul. It's been like, I think the last time I made a haul video was Sunday. So I feel kind of like, oh my gosh, what the heck am I doing? Um, so I did go shopping. This is a collaboration of like, I went Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday. So many, many trips as I had zero bonus cash on my store cards. So like this was like starting from zero to the top. Some amazing deals over at Rite Aid this week. We have a little bit extra at... um good old Walgreens and then we have a Meyer deal and I have something else but I didn't pick up uh, the one item that's super cheap also this week but I did grab a bunch of these um, Clorox toilet bowl cleaners for uh, 29 cents each and I'll talk about that in a quick second. Let's do a quick little weather report for you guys and um, kind of a mild one today. I'm really enjoying the new car. A lot of you were saying hey what'd you get? I got a mid-size uh, GMC SUV and I'm absolutely loving it and um yeah, just a nice kind of different, you know, when you get a new car and you're like, hey, how do I do this? How do I do that? I know a lot of you really enjoyed uh, the tour video that I made yesterday, like saying goodbye to my old car. <laughs> but uh, the old girl had to go to pasture. The Kelly Blue Book for the car was really, really low and I needed to put like just under $5,000 of repairs and it just mathematically was not going to work for me because um, the winters are really hard on cars up here. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to talk about, even before I talk about my awesome haul, is uh, a video I made yesterday, um, just a dollar general preview for the 5 off of 25. As I stated in that video, um, Daisy liked that video too. Um, we're not sure right now if that 5 off of 25 um, digital coupon will come off without any problems. And that's just being said uh, from past experience uh, when they have the 2 off of 10. Sometimes on Saturday morning, um, it's not going to come off. And um, share, share, share on social media, on videos, in the comments. And I'll, I'll definitely pin on all of those videos if it is or is not working. Um, and that's just being smart because do you really want to spend an extra $5 on these hauls? The answer to that is no. This is extreme couponing. It's not extreme shopping. So, you know, it's just like one of those sort of things. And another little um, problem in my video, um, the automatic three off 15 for the Scots, either the toilet paper or paper towel. Online, it says it's still ongoing. However, in the flyer, it said that it ended yesterday. So that's a mistake on my part, and I do apologize about it. Um, if you plan on getting some um, Scott's paper towel, um, $16 worth, if you want to recalibrate your math to subtract $3, um, you can do that. Um, but just um, just be smart with the math. If you still want to proceed ahead with that because you think it's a really good deal, um, you'll basically be paying, I think, like $1.38 per product, which is still like really good, especially for a 12-pack or a six pack of either the Scott's toilet paper or paper towel. So, I mean, just play that one by ear, but uh, full transparency. Yep. I did make a mistake. Um, so I just wanted to throw that out there and, um, we will let you guys definitely know also on Saturday morning if the 5 off of 25 um, digital coupon is working or what the story is. Um, we'll be right on top of that. And I know there's a lot of really smart Dollar General shoppers who um, watch my YouTube channel and um, we'll just get to the bottom of that. So that being said, let's start talking about this amazing haul. We're going to start off at Walgreens because I know a lot of you really love Walgreens. And um, I did grab another one of these Mentos on um, Tuesday thinking, you know, um, Sunday it wasn't printing. I thought maybe Tuesday it would print. This guy is $1.29. I paid cash out of pocket for this. And I thought I would get back a $1.29 register reward. And it, guess what? It didn't print. And um, the manager at the store, it was a young kid and he was really not sure. And I just said, hey, can I just grab another one? And we'll just call it good. And he's like, oh yes, that'll be great. So, <laughs> so it was 
interesting enough. And uh, I don't know why on my store card I'm having a lot of issues. And I only have one Walgreens store card. Um, so maybe my card has been flagged or something like that, or I'm too much of a shopper over there. I've heard various stories on that, but who knows what the truth is. Um, it could be all pie in the sky at this point, but um, there's a hundred different ways to do deals over at Walgreens, not including register rewards. I'm just kind of pissed off that their advertising um, in their flyer that you'll, you're will you gonna get a register reward, but nothing's printing. And it's not like I'm going in there and I'm hell on wheels and screaming at the cashiers either. Like I'm usually loosey goosey, super friendly, super nice. Um, I actually had, um, a store employee write in the comments a couple days ago to ask me to stop yelling at the, the, the staff at Walgreens and uh, I've certainly never endorsed that or done that and usually if people get crazy with me I just walk out of the store and that's what I advocate I don't advocate fighting so I'm not sure where that came from but it was a very odd comment this woman saying don't yell at people I'm like I wasn't never yelling I mean sometimes if I make a funny voice it's just for comedic purposes <laughs> but uh, we certainly don't. Anyhow, that young uh, manager, I just said, hey, can I grab this? And he's like, yes. And that's what that's what happened. So case closed. <laughs> a couple other items I found on clearance because there's been a ton of clearance. I will link a video at the very end if you're interested. Um, a lot of this stuff is 90 and it's fantastic. Um, a couple days ago, I got a bunch of drinks, apple juice, um, this type of uh, raspberry juice. And then I got a whole bunch of um, La Croix, um, drinks and then some Perrier as well. My husband loves all of it and I love all of it and it's really nice to stock my pantry just flipping points for stuff 90% clearance, you know, drink wise. Um, another thing that I found on clearance and I did not even have any coupons with me um, when I was visiting the store. These guys were $1.29 each so I basically grabbed all four that I could find and I just rolled $5 in points. This is actually something that I use and I mean like to pay $1.29 for these and they're usually $12.99. We have a, a long expiry date on them and there's the UPC if you wanna check. Like it's good till May the 21st of 2021. So I'll definitely use all these. All for me, not giving any of these away. And then um, some of these um, St. Ives um, cleaning sticks and they were 99 cents each just to show you the UPC as well for this one. And this is in the scent um, Cactus Water and Hibiscus, this guy. So um, these are ringing up buy one, get one 50% off. So two of them is $1.48. I know we had a dollar a dollar fifty coupon and a lot of people are probably going to ask like hey how would i use that dollar fifty coupon on this because there is no overage or coupons don't like automatically deduct um over at good old walgreens and what i would suggest is to get at least a dollar fifty of merch so grab all four of them and use one coupon and it should scan but this is just a really good find um when these first came out they're like about ten dollars a piece um i did try one and i still have one in my bathroom and i really enjoy it um but for the most part, like I would never just buy this because $10, that's just way too much. I only buy stuff on clearance. So that's my little um, clearance haul. Uh, the next little thing that I did, and I did this on two separate transactions, um, and this is a pretty solid little deal. And I actually posted this yesterday on my Instagram because I thought it was a great deal. Woo, don't Jenga, Jenga. <laughs> so for this deal, I grabbed two tubes of toothpaste and one thing of Oxy. The second transaction, two tubes of toothpaste, or one thing of Oxy. So let's look at the math, shall we? Um, the tubes of toothpaste are $3.99 a piece, and then the Oxy is $2.99. That is a subtotal of $10.97. I had $2 coupons from the smart source of March the 17th, so two of them subtracting $4. If you purchase inserts from Sandra Coupon Hustler, this was in the um, March 17th bundle, just to let you guys know as are the um, the coupons for the um, Oxy, so another $2 off. So that's $6 of coupons right there. I paid $4.97, not including tax out of pocket. In Michigan, you can use some points to cover the tax, so I surrendered 5,000 points right there, and I paid the balance of the tax, it was like 60 something cents. And then I got back 4,000 points because the deal this week is when you buy two of these Colgates, you get back 4,000 points, making it a dollar for 10 bucks of merch for the two tubes and that. That's $10 this week. And then I paid a buck for that. So it is a loss of 1000 points, but to get all of this stuff for like, you know, losing a dollar of points, I'm totally cool with that. 
So yeah, just a really awesome little um, Walgreens haul. But even before we head on to Rite Aid, I'm going to talk really quickly about my HelloFresh box. I know a lot of you love to just see what I'm eating this week. And these are the meals that I ordered. We have this veggie rice bowl. It looks super delicious. This is what we had yesterday, this Juicy Lucy burger, also really yummy. And then this chicken um, sausage uh, pasta dish. And I made this the first night that we got the box because it was really quick. It's like five minutes of prep and 30 minutes of cooking. That's how I do it. And then as you can see, there's a one to six um, directions. They basically send you all the ingredients and you assemble your food. It's very easy and the meals are very delicious. And I'm not a chef, but I can follow this and I can make really nice meals. And um, if you are interested, I have a code in the notes for $40 off your first box. And this is for new signups only. Basically just press the link and it'll take you to the HelloFresh page. Give it like 30 seconds and at the top it'll say $40 coupon code um, applied. And then you just sign up. And if you wanna just, you know, it's pay your $20, get your three meals and shipping, the shipping is included as well, which is fantastic. And then if you want to just um, cancel your account at that point or put your account on pause or whatever, you can do that too. So just get like, you know, three meals for like, you know, probably like $6 a piece for two servings, which is really fantastic. I have been with HelloFresh for um, about a year. I've had options to try other food, other food services, but this one um, we're gonna stick with forever because it's so good, it's convenient. My husband and I, we both work from home and there's just like, it's really nice to have everything just prepped. And there's no messing around at the grocery store looking for like little ingredients. Everything's just provided. And if I ever wanna make like say this dish again, I have all of the ingredients with all the ingredients and then the proper directions, which is fantastic. So if you're interested, um, check out that link. You guys will not be disappointed. And I mean, I just love this. I, I love this company. It's just absolutely fantastic. Okay, the next store that we have is Rite Aid and many apologies um, to the faithful people that watch my channel that um, are here for Rite Aid only. Um, I have not been there in a very long time. I had like this much bonus cash and I just, yeah, I just think the deals haven't been there. It's a lot easier to shop at uh, Walgreens for me. And, uh, but I did find a couple of deals. Um, so the first one was this, these two little guys on clearance. And it is this um, scissors for, tw it's for tweezing like hair. And this guy was actually 99 cents, even though it says $1.99. And there is the UPC if you want to look for this guy at your store. And then this little um, nail file, it looks very sharp. And there is also the UPC if you want to screenshot it. Hopefully he's focusing. There it is. So these two were 99 cents a piece, which is really nice. And then we had that dollar coupon from the March 17th Smart Source, making it free. And that coupon scanned perfectly on these items. Uh, there was no beeps, no issues, no problems. And if you bought um, the 317 inserts from Sandra, you would have that coupon in your bundle. Um, the next little uh, Revlon deal that we're going to talk about, um, I picked up, I think, six of these polishes, and they're in these traditional bottles by Revlon. And then one of these, um, it's a color gel one, and this guy is 219. So um, that's a whole hodgepodge. Here are the colors if you want to screenshot or look for them in your store. If you want to look for them in your store, take a quick screenshot. And to show you the math of what I did, um, so six of the old fashioned ones at $1.49, and then one of the more fancy gel ones for $2.19. That is a subtotal right there of $11.13. I had seven coupons from my smart source of March the 17th, and so that subtracted 14 bucks, and it basically made it free plus $2.87 of overage. And then when you spend um, $10 on certain types of Revlon cosmetics, you're gonna get back $3 of bonus cash. So for me, I mean, this was just a really big money maker. And from the money I had from this, I basically bought this box of Kleenex for $3.99. So it just covered most of this. So that was fantastic. Um, the next little deal that I did was I grabbed um, a whole bunch of these. They're called deodorant wipes. And this is a newer product by Unilever. So I grabbed um, two of the Degree Ladies, two of the, the Dove Women's, and then two of the Dove Men's. And they are all priced um, two for 10. So two for 10 times three is 30 bucks, subtracting the $2 coupons from the Retail Me Not. And um, they have coupons for all the different ones, including the Men's Axe, but I didn't grab those. 
Um, so anyhow, that subtracted $12. I paid 18 out of pocket and then got back $10 of bonus cash, making each one $1.33. And I got some mad points from Fetch Rewards for this because this is part of the Unilever family, which is fantastic. Um, a quick little deal with Checkout 51. I grabbed five of these um, cookies and this week they're priced with gold discount at um, 63 cents each. So that's $3.15 I paid out of pocket. Checkout 51 is giving back 75 cents for each of them. So I got back 375, making it free plus a 60 cent money maker. Have a Rite Aid in your neighborhood and you have not signed up for Checkout 51, you might want to consider signing up. And if you use my um, link in the notes, you'll get an extra $5 when you sign up and submit your first couple receipts. But every other week, there's either free cookies or free something um, at one of the stores. And um, they're really trying to entice people to use Checkout 51. So loving this deal with Checkout 51. And who does not like some free cookies. Uh, the next little deal I did is um, I got 10 of these Oreo um, candy bars. You can do seven per transaction. So I did um, a couple each day. I didn't grab all of them at once because I didn't want any problems at the cash register. And so they are 55 cents. There is a 55 cent coupon from the Smart Source of March the 17th, making it free. And uh, there is no limit on that coupon, just to note that. Another little freebie uh, for this store card is I grabbed two of the Russell Stouffer's Easter candies. They are um, two for a dollar, so I paid a dollar out of pocket, got back a dollar of bonus cash. The limit of that is one per store card. I found a couple more of these um, Clairol Color Crave um, hair dyes. These were $2.47 each, so two of them is $4.94, and there's a six off of two um, coupon. From a recent insert, it gave me a buck six of overage. And then these little craves, um, they're just a hair color. It's not even a dye. They were 274 times two is $5.48. And again, I used that six off of two, giving me 52 cents overage. So for all of this, it was like three bucks of overage, which is really super duper. And I did these over different transactions because I did visit the store many, many times because um, I was in there a lot this week um, working with the bonus cash I, I had. And then the final deal, this is super duper. You grab two of these um, cleaners or face washes and then two bags of the um, makeup wipes. And here's the math, guys. I, I One of them must have been more than the other. I'm not sure which one. But one was $7.99, the second one was $3.99, and then we had one for $6.99 and one for $3.49. That right there is a subtotal of $22.46. I used two BOGO free coupons um, from, I think, the Retail Me Not of um, March the 17th. So two of those, and it, or, it subtracted $6.99. And how I did this is I got the cashier to scan all of my stuff in my um, basket first, gave her the coupons and scanned my store card last. So the maximum value of the coupons would come off. After all of that, I paid $8.48 out of pocket. There's a special, you get $7 of bonus cash when you spend 20. So basically makes these products $1.48 um, for the four or 37 cents each. Like 37 cents for some makeup wipes or some face cream. Yes, please and thank you so much. And this is stuff that like my in-laws love, my mom loves. I'm not a really big fan of the simple line, but I know this will definitely, somebody will really enjoy this. So happy to get that. And when my bonus cash finally resets from this purchase today, I'll definitely go and do that deal one more time. Okay, so the final store that we have is Meyer, and another apology. I'm very sorry, guys. I haven't been um, at Meyer a lot lately because I've been busy with work and other stuff, um, and it's just one of those things. Uh, so in our March the 3rd insert, there was either a dollar off any Clorox Pine Sol product or a dollar off two for the um, Clorox Sentiva products. And Clorox bleach, these were a dollar sixty-nine times five. That's a price point of eight dollars and forty-five cents. Buy five, save five came off, so it's three forty-five. And I used um, two dollar off twos from your smart source of March the third, subtracting two bucks, made it a buck forty-five for five or twenty-nine cents each, which is fantastic. On the next day, from the same insert, I just repeated the deal. And the coupons, the cashier had to approve them, which I don't really fully understand, but whatever. So now I have ten of these and. 
and um, yeah, just some extra cheap toilet cleaner for 29 cents each. Special shout out and thank you to Wanda Tennyson. Um, she was mentioning this to me earlier in the week and I had seen the deal, but I just didn't have time to get out to the store and nobody's doing this deal because my store was fully, fully stocked the two days that I went shopping there. So happy to get 10 of these. And another little cheapy is the uh, Vaseline. Um, it's really cheap, so you might want to check out either the first aid or in the lotion section for that. And the Meyer brand is also uh, 99 cents, so you might want to check that out. I know a lot of us went really hard last summer with the first aid stuff over at Walgreens, so I absolutely don't want any more petroleum jelly in my stockpile. <laughs> I have so much of that. So that's it for this video, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one.